Hey lovelies, karibuni sana back to my YouTube channel. Shila zwaji kwa jikodi. Oh, first of all, I am sorry I am sitting outside. I was enjoying the sunset and I thought why not shoot the intro for the first video of the year. The sunset is beautiful by the way. I love sunsets. But karibuni sana, Aki, thank you so much for not unsubscribing to this dormant channel. I am back for good we are not going anywhere and if i do go anywhere i will apologize and leave a message saying this is the last video we're shooting last year was a lot a lot a lot but to thank god we are back we got um help you know um but yeah we're here we thank the heavens i hope you guys miss me oh i've missed this whole thing as well and i think i have forgotten how to do these things as well i keep I think this is like the fifth time I'm shooting this intro and this better work. But anyways, Karibuni Sana. I am so sorry guys I left you hanging like that. Thank you for those people who um came to my Instagram, my WhatsApp to ask me what's going on, why is there no new content? I am sorry guys. Life life. Things happened. But by the grace of God, we're here. And we thank him. We're grateful. So yeah, um it's the season of mangoes. So today's episode it's something mango, of course. Before the mango season disappears, I want you guys to try mango salsa. It's salsa, kachumbari, but with mangoes. It's amazing. Best believe. I'm topping mine on fish tacos, um, which I have shot fish tacos before. I'll link it in the description box. So I'm, I'll still show you bits and pieces of me still making the fish tacos all over again. But I'll link an episode where I did the video, the game night with friends. It was amazing. Also, I think I should be doing that like every three months. If you want to be in a video with me and um, friends as we play games and drink up and eat food, sign up. Sign up. You love it. But yeah, um, the mango salsa slaps. You can have it with um, anything chicken, anything. I did mine with biryani on Sunday. It was amazing. I loved it. And so yeah, you can literally just pair it up with anywhere where you need a salad or a salsa. It's amazing. You, I, I know you love it. I didn't get a chance to shoot the ending of me trying the meal because I got friends over and Moshene, Moshene, so we didn't get to like try it out. But it was amazing, best believe. But thank you so much, guys, for sticking around. I think I should also like introduce a segment whereby we discuss issues that people can't talk about yet they're going through. But, anyways. Um, we'll see about that. For now, let's stick to food. Karibuni sana to Sheila's Magical Jikoni, where we live life with a little spice. The home of unforgettable flavors. I had missed that. Oh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. I have new friends in my life now. Hi, welcome to my life. Comment, share, 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 share. And let's continue growing. Again, thank you for not unsubscribing. Thanks. Take care. We have um, some fresh coriander leaves looking so lovely tomatoes diced onions that are soaking in some salty water because i don't like the taste of raw onions so they're soaking in salty water and then we have fresh mango very yum this is some yogurt for our sauce or mala if you have some fresh lime juice this is mayo and then for the spices that we're using today we have some onion powder garlic powder paprika salt and some black pepper and of course our fish fillet so for the star of this show, um, definitely the mangoes. I've used two mangoes. I'll add some lemon juice to it. Oops, the seeds. Because um, when you bite into this, you're gonna hate why you have it. Rather, you didn't um, check properly. Then um, I go in with my tomatoes. Just used one big tomato for this recipe my onions just throw everything inside literally and then some fresh coriander leaves finally season it with some salt just to taste it's a sweet and sour type of um, salsa if you want to add chilies please do um, of late I haven't been taking a lot of chilies so I'm staying away from it but 
it pairs really well with some hotness and yeah that's just simply it your mango salsa look at that it looks so good i want to quickly season my um my fish fillet so that um it gets to marinate for at least 30 minutes i'll do a little bit of some lime juice just um a little bit um get both sides and then we have some paprika rub it in So you will let your fish to marinate for about 20-30 minutes before pan searing it to get the nice brown color and just cooking it. You can air fry it if you want or you can bake it. I'll just be pan searing it. So now we pan sear our fish. Our pan is nice and hot. Make sure it gets all the juices. Tip. You don't know why it's ready to flip when they actually um, stop sticking to the pan. This is the perfect brown. It's already. Um, pretty much cooked so once it's done we'll just flick it up otherwise get the perfect brown so I want to make um, some sort of tartar sauce for our fish add the mayo to the plain yogurt or mala again I have already an episode of this so you can just refer to it just in case a bit some a bit of some lime juice and then season it with some salt and pepper add some lemon zest to just give it a kick if you want and some chilies as well if you want some heat but this works perfectly for me and some salt So instead of um, lemon zest, I have some orange zest here. So this is what I will add to just give it a nice sweetness. That's it. So um, this part I'll just um, attach the link to the previous video that I made so that you follow the steps but for now I'm just gonna mix everything up it's just like making chapatis because I'm just making a simple wrap but that's it So I want to roll this out and make um, balls out of it to like roll out our wraps. There's the recipe that I will attach but so here I'll just do a time lapse but you'll get the drift.
So everything is ready. The only thing that we are to do now is layer things up. So you place your wrap. Start with the fish. Then put your tartar sauce on top of the fish. Then top it with the mango salsa. Then you fold it to make it into a wrap. You can also squeeze in some lemon juice to just give it a nice kick. And there we have it. Fish tacos with mango salsa.